Welcome back to On Air, the movie podcast, where we talk about, guess what, movies. And today, the, the movie, or the musical we should, I, uh, we're going to be talking about today is Hairspray, the 2007 one, because I like that one better. All right, does anyone want to start us off with our, our general thoughts here? No. No. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll go first then. Um, I really, really like this musical. It's awesome. That's, that's, yeah. <laughs> I'll go more in depth on that later, but it was okay. I definitely <laughs> watched it before when I was younger, but when I was watching it, I was doing so many other stuff. It felt like I, I didn't watch it, mm -hmm. but it was good. Yeah. Too many songs. What? It's a musical. <laughs> you mean too many songs? <laughs> no, it was a musical. I thought it was like those... I thought it was like that dumb thing they do when they like take a musical and they make it a movie, like they make a remake and don't put music in it. I thought it was one of those. Oh yeah, but it's not. It's just a musical. I guess so. <laughs> okay, so um, <laughs> gen we characters we characters? liked. Um, Since that's next on the list, and we have nothing else to say for general thoughts. Okay then. Um, I wanted to, oh, um, I really like Seaweed. I was surprised, I was listening to the soundtrack um, before this, because I've seen the movie many times and I didn't need to rewatch it, but um, I was surprised that Seaweed only really sings in like a few songs, like two or Is three Is she the maybe. one that like wins at the end? Seaweed? Seaweed's yeah. the boy. Oh. Seaweed's, oh, seaweed's uh, no. Penny's uh, oh, boyfriend. Oh, it does say, Oh, okay. Silly. Oh, no. I, um, but yeah, uh, I was surprised. He, he doesn't sing as much as I would think because he shows up pretty early on in the movie that I would think he sung more. Uh, and Penny, too. She doesn't sing as much as I would have hoped. She was really good. Oh, yeah. She like only sang at the end. Uh, when mm -hmm. I started watching, I thought Penny was the main character, and I was so confused, and I was like, why are we focusing on Tracy? Because she's the main character. I realized like 25 minutes in, and I was like, oh. <laughs> yeah, I think Penny might have been my favorite. Mm, that's fair. Um, <laughs> I don't have a reason why, but. Corny Collins. I loved Corny Collins. Wait, Corny he Collins just, was awesome. Also, Link. He's such a nice guy. Link. Oh, Link, yeah. Probably because it's Zac Afron and like. Zac like, Afron? <laughs> I was, I was not expecting him to be in this movie. That was such a surprise. Una texted me about it, and it was oh, like yeah. 11.30, and I didn't believe her, and then I watched it, and then it was like, I'm Link, and it was that one piece of hair, and I was like, what the heck? <laughs> that one piece of hair. <laughs> it was just Zac cool. Efron. Corny Collins was cool. Mm -hmm. He wasn't bad like the other woman. Yeah. Um, what a bad woman. <laughs> I also really liked... Um, uh, Maybell, she was awesome too. I just what really is that? she's the 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 woman with the she's the <laughs> Baltimore Rhythm and Blues radio DJ. It says oh, right there. Is it the is it the, the woman lady? who owns the seaweed mom? Yeah. Oh yeah, I know. Who yeah, that her. Is. I like her. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's cool. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. cool. the mom was funny. Oh yeah, I loved the mom. Edna. Edna. Mm -hmm. Edna was played by John Travolta. <laughs> he was awesome. Oh my goodness. Like what a woman. Genuinely. Oh yeah, he was fantastic. Can I just say though, like the the chemistry between Edna and um Wilbur was like actually insane. Like I don't know what I was thinking the first time I watched it. I think I genuinely would believe that Edna was a woman or like that John was a woman. Like I genuinely but maybe that's just me cuz I'm not the brightest. But, <laughs> <laughs> but you know it's okay. Um, uh, but but yeah, I uh, <laughs> I just really like their chemistry. Okay, I don't know why they felt so natural. You know, like I think yeah, Link Larkin is a weird name. <laughs> Link Larkin. I would not <laughs> Link Larkin. It, that last name does not seem real. I just. <laughs> These last names, Pingleton, Pingleton. Turnblad, Corny Collins, 
Yeah. Like who? who? Spubs. Spubs. Oh my god, Spub? Spub yes, reference? Spubs. That says Stubs. But <laughs> Spub reference? Aww. No one except us Pingleton gets Pingleton is actually crazy. I just crazy. realized how crazy some of these last names are. Like yeah. Collins is a normal one. But then you name Tussle? him Corny. Tussle? Tussle. Yeah, Vaughn Tussle. Tussle. <laughs> Vaughn Tussle. <laughs> Wild. Um... Uh, did, did did anyone have like a well, let's talk about songs because it's a musical so crazy i know right no, i don't remember any... i don't memorize any of the words in the songs that is okay i no kids we want you to sing it yeah oh, all sing of it them right now right now right now a um, whole podcast is gonna be over the rainbow so no that is just that's not no. the right movie at all um but yeah i think i i have don't worry kenzie i haven't memorized the songs either um i do i have like I do know most of them. Like, this, if you play the song, I'll, like, sing along, and I'll know most of the words. This made me realize but. I am not a fan of musicals, because after the mm-hmm. fourth song, I just skip to the end of the songs. That's fair. I was um, not a fan. Yeah, I know musicals aren't for everyone. I just, I'm just, like, a giant theater kid, so, you know. Um, so I just really like them. Uh, but um, uh, my favorite song is probably Without Love. I really like that one. I don't know why. Um, I also like, uh, the, the one at the end, I forget what it's called, um, the world keeps spinning round and round, that one, um, that one always gets stuck in my head, like, I'll, yeah? The first song. The first song? Yeah. Good morning, Baltimore? Yeah, the nice kids Good in the, Good morning, Like, Baltimore. when they're, like, the nice kids in the neighborhood. Oh. Oh, good nicest to, kids in town. Yeah, nicest kids. That was a good. One. Nicest kids in town. That's that the um, uh, intro song to the Corny Collins show. That's they why I like play it every so episode. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. Um, does anyone want to? Um, do, do, uh, I, Una, favorite song. Go. So I didn't like any of them. That's so I, like uh, we were talking about this earlier, musicals are kind of hit or miss for me because mm-hmm. it really just depends on if I like the music. Yeah. So I don't think the songs were bad, just not what I listen to at all. Yeah. So no, it's definitely not what you listen to. Yeah. Your it music is taste not. is just like Iron Maiden. <laughs> cover it up. Cover yeah. it up. Ashamed. Ashamed. Um. Yeah. I for like because La La Land is mm-hmm. one of my favorite movies which also is a musical oh my God, but i, I love, think the love La La Land. i was thinking about that compared to this just because like two mm-hmm. musicals that come to mind yeah that's same thing with like hamilton and the heights i really like when i think of those like i the compared to you can tell the songs to me anyway you can tell that the songs from this are for a musical like they're mm-hmm. very musically and i know some people like that mm-hmm. but for dance. me like the music in like la la land like um another day is or city of stars if you know that movie those songs to me like don't they don't have the same like in your face like stuff that this one does and like also voice i did like the voices of the singers but oh, they yeah. were they they had a different feel to them than some of the other and i know they're two different like very different movies mm-hmm. so it's hard to compare it's like comparing apples to oranges but mm. i don't i didn't love the music in this one that's okay but if i had to pick one i guess the the same one kenji said the intro to the show was like probably the one i liked the most mm-hmm. but just think of us doing that song you know mm-hmm. uh is there a song that you didn't like because i have a least favorite <laughs> okay so like up until like the fourth song yeah. I was like, I don't like this. So then I skipped all of the songs. Uh-huh. So. What's the fourth song? Do I don't remember. remember. So fourth <laughs> to the end of the movie. Did not like any of those. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, there are, I will say, there are a few songs that, like, when I'm listening to, like, the soundtrack, I, like, skip over them completely. Uh, there is, like, two. Link has two different songs. And, and they're so boring. They're just, like, generic love songs that don't have any importance to the plot whatsoever one question. of them was just yeah sorry to interrupt no you're good <laughs> I, I, would, I like doing that one song uh, maybe it's because i spaced out and i came mm-hmm. back but he was like in his room and he just had like a picture 
of Tracy, and I was so confused. That, that's Tracy's room. Yeah. Oh, he, he was, was in, in Tracy's, Tracy's room. room. How long did I space out? Um, A lot, because Tracy got, like, no, Tracy, she was on Tracy the run. No, Tracy assaulted a police officer, so she didn't go home, and then he came to her house, and then... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um yeah no um uh, that that uh i did like that song without love it's i would say that one's my favorite i think i already said that i don't remember i tuned myself out um i think that's my issue with the like musicals mm-hmm. i feel like i tune myself out too much because i feel like at some point it's like i don't like when there's too many songs so then i skip them but then i mm-hmm. also feel like I'll, I'll miss something important to the plot so then it's just yeah. weird because it's like I like movies with plots. I don't like nothing in between. It's plot, plot, plot. Mm-hmm. But then when it's plot, music, plot, music, plot, music, it's like, I need my plot, 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 plot. I did kind of feel yeah. like the points of the songs were, like, repeated. Like, I I don't... So, like, in I guess in Hamilton, since it's, like, all music, yeah. they tell the story through the songs. And mm-hmm. not that they don't do that in this one, but, like, they make their point right away, and then it's just kind of that over and over. Mm-hmm. For like the four minutes that that song lasts, do they even Which, talk in Hamilton? Like, do they act? Uh, there's I mean, they, like a few scenes they, where like, they talk, act, but is no, no, there? no, no, no. Wait, no, no, no. Like talk, talk, but not like music. I don't know talk, if it was like this. Never seen Hamilton. N- no, Hamilton is no. I'm. It's like really. I thought Hamilton based. was like yeah. all music. There's like a few scenes where they like speak instead of sing. Well, yeah, but there's still music like in the background. Mm. I think so. I don't know. I haven't seen Hamilton in forever. I, I didn't like a musical, Hamilton. I'll be honest. I like it just because I liked the music in it. I hate his I like so. La La Land. La La Land's like <laughs> one of my favorite movies of all time. Mm-hmm. It's so good. I photoshopped a picture of me and Una on the La La Land poster. Oh, mm-hmm. I remember that. That was funny. Why do um, people keep photoshopping me onto, onto movie posters? Like... It was the one that Theo did of Dune Part Two, and it I'm was gonna like Photoshop you on the Quiet Place. Dune Part Tuna? That's I'm, I'm so gonna, funny. I'm gonna Photoshop you on the Quiet Place one mm-hmm. as the monster, as the alien, and I'm the cat. <laughs> it's the. I don't know. I haven't seen that movie. Yeah. <laughs> um. But wait um, a minute. How? What? what? If we didn't know that we were gonna do that until Kenzie got here, how was oh. it already on there? Shh. Um. I don't I know. snuck into Dez's house <laughs> and typed it up in the middle of the night. All right. Um, suspicious. That, that, what do you mean? Sus- <laughs> okay. No, but that was like a question. Never mind. Did we have... Um, oh, wait. I wanted to talk about my least uh, favorite song. Uh, yes. I, the, the, the scene where they're marching, it's a really important scene, but I just skip over that song always just because it's... Like, it's nothing like crazy special and it just it takes so long i'm also not a fan of like the the uh, uh, what style what what genre is it i forget is it uh oh wait rhythm and blues yeah no I, i'm not a fan of like that genre so i kind of skip over that song but um i'm losing my c of it man <laughs> okay. there's like no more c of up in here it's just okay green tea. okay 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 it's not green it's you are colorblind. That is very clearly pink. That is very clearly pink. Yeah, because it's strawberry dragon fruit with green tea in it because some weirdos... Where's the green? <laughs> I, don't, I don't see any green. Yeah, I don't, do we see any green? I don't see any That's green. why you're going to be the monster <laughs> in the quiet place. <laughs> I don't see any green there, buddy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> maybe, maybe we're the colorblind ones, all right? Maybe. Mm-hmm. Green tea doesn't have to be green. Then yeah, it's it not does. green tea. It no, it doesn't. Then orange, it's like, okay, okay, okay. Orange okay. juice is like yellow if you want to be technical. No. Yes. I feel it's like, like orange, an orangey yellow. It's, no, I feel it's like orange a bright juice orange, like a, but it's it's definitely not yellow. No, it's like the dandy all dandy <laughs> on crayon. Pardon? <laughs> no. What are you saying? No, it's okay. the Crayola like dandelion color shade. Please don't turn this into a coconut thing. What? The you pronouncing things wrong. Coconut. That's just her coconut. accent. Accent. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Anyway, Did you <laughs> making fun of my accent right now? That's <laughs> crazy. Accent. Cancel. Are you Una. making fun of my accent? Cancel Una, is guys. That, that's not an accent, is it? It's I'm just putting a. a yeah. I'm gonna. It's slight. Articulation. Guys, thing? put a buzz over Una, and it's like. <laughs> eh. 
We're gonna um, blur her face out. Try not Isn't to get canceled. Soundboard? Anyways, um, uh, Give a womp did we womp. have a <laughs> did we have um, like a favorite like scene or anything or? When he's in the room, when he's in a room and he's singing that song uh-huh. to the thing, and he's like, I yeah, that was, that was very really Zac Efron. Mm-hmm. Mm, I will say I didn't yeah. like the song, but I did think it was sweet when Tracy like finally has her mom like come outside and she's like oh. really excited. Oh about yeah, welcome it to the sixties. Welcome to Probably. the sixties. They had a nice oh, relationship. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, but like her mom is very introverted mm-hmm. and then she finally touches grass she goes outside yeah and it hasn't left the house since 1951 god 51. dang and it's the 60s now so that's like nine years that's crazy yeah, she went outside and she's like oh the air is so fresh oh she did she said that. it was she said it was too fresh oh yeah and i also i don't know why but i also really liked um uh, when when they're in mr pinky's shop and they hand uh he hands them donuts and and um edna's just like eat your donuts hon mm-hmm. i i swear i i love john travolta he was so good at, as edna do you guys I, think that yeah. if this movie took place like now that tracy's mom would be like chronically online facebook mom because <laughs> like she doesn't go outside or at least she, she just i think at, she in would. the first half she doesn't mm-hmm. go outside i think she wouldn't even post stuff and she just posts like those like relatable facebook minion memes, memes that aren't oh relatable God, yeah. <laughs> just minion memes and she's, she's never minions. even and then, seen the minion and then movies. hold on where was she desiree reference <laughs> desiree's mom reference sorry um hold on <laughs> yeah what's the what's the mom i don't oh penny yeah no oh uh, not prudence penny. Prudence. No, it was like Amber's mom. Oh, Amber's mom is yeah. Velma. The Velma. one who's like evil and yeah. very yeah. abusive. Very racist. Yeah, um, the racist one. We hate her. I didn't, honestly, I didn't expect there to be so much racism in this. Like, I know it took place I, in the 60s. Yeah. But I was oblivious. It's like smack middle, dur- like smack, 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 dab. smack dab middle in the, thank you. Uh, it was in the middle of the whole like movement so of course of course it's gonna be you know about that like i don't what, what made you think it wasn't gonna be that like i don't know i i was dumb and i thought it took place in 2007 like the movie <laughs> said <laughs> that's just when it came out bro <laughs> <laughs> um oh god my voice cracked yeah i don't know i didn't think it was gonna be mm-hmm. about like the inclusion stuff i mm-hmm wouldn't have guessed that from like the trailers and st- I didn't watch the trailers. I <laughs> wouldn't have guessed that from what I already knew about it, which was mm-hmm. very limited. But Velma I knew it was about like um, a bad show. Stuff. No, yeah, I didn't actually. That's okay, okay, <laughs> Kenzie. <Like. laughs> mm. What did you want to say about Velma? She seems like the type that Scooby would pull Doo up reference? a picture from like five years, ago, like when she was five years old and she like won a pageant and she'd be like, I'm still this talented and then put like a picture of her like next to it. And it's like, no, <laughs> no. She seems like she'd brag about being valedictorian of her eighth grade class. <laughs> um, Is it bad that I don't know what that means? Valedictorian? Yeah, I don't know what that means. It's like you're, you're really highest really grade, top of your class. Oh, in eighth grade. In eighth grade, <laughs> she has a whole song about when she was Balti- Miss Baltimore Crabs. Velma? Also, yeah, I thought her last name was Crabs for a little while. Miss Baltimore Crabs. <laughs> Velma, Velma I forget Crabs. that one. Was that earlier on? Uh, that, when they yeah, were that was when audition. she was auditioning. Yeah. So. Oh, then I might have been falling asleep. I don't know. Yeah. The, I watched the first half hour and then like got tired so i stopped and then watched that's the fair. rest of it earlier you know that, that's I mean, fair no later what huh? <laughs> it's okay <laughs> it's okay i don't know it's okay take your time buddy Bad. hey <laughs> stop 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 <laughs> Get, stay Back in up. your stay in your side your segment of I'm the gonna, table you, next time we should hook una up outside <laughs> like behind the thing just like pans to the empty wall. That'd be funny if it was like one of these was gone and it was <laughs> us trying to do the podcast through the window. <laughs> I'm just yelling at the okay. window. Okay. Um, 
I want to do. Um, I lost my train of thought. Does someone else have anything to say while I remember? Uh, it was favorite part of, like, favorite scene or anything. Oh, yeah, favorite scene. I yeah. said I liked when he was singing in Tracy's, but right. when he was like, yeah, love. Mm. And then he grabs the picture and he's like. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I want um, I, I, I think the reason cool. why I just really liked that song was because, like, throughout the majority of the movie, they're all, like, like they, they act more like young adults in my opinion but this one felt very like teenagery to me because it's like um because <laughs> it's like um <laughs> because, because it's i don't know they have like certain lines where it's like uh the the one that i always like go to is like the um the part where um, Link is like, Trace, I want to kiss ya. And then it's Tracy in the trunk of the car. And she's like, let me out at the next toll. Mm. I don't know. It's very like, I don't know. It just had that whole like like childish-esque kind of thing to me. And I just appreciate teenagers being teenagers, you know? I don't really see it. They're, they're very like mature for their age. And I know mm. it was the 60s, so different like social constructs and mm. stuff. So it's Sk- obviously no skibbity like toilet. <laughs> no skibbity <laughs> no toilet. No iPad. iPad. <laughs> no iPad. No attention decreasing. No brain rot. Yeah. <laughs> oh. No dress to they, impress. They took I their I played dress to impress away. with Luke Action last night. I just wanted to share that. <laughs> okay. Dude, we gotta get him on the podcast. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> what? The Does Grinch? he even watch? <laughs> 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 just the only movies he shows up in are like oh, green. He's gonna, he's yeah. gonna mask? Oh, yeah. <laughs> what was that podcast episode when you guys introduced and he was said, and Luke Ekstrom? Like, in the no, background. No, N- Noah was in the background. No, I th- no, it was Luke Ekstrom. No. And Una was like, no, you didn't sign the he waiver. He helped with Monty Python. Yeah, it was Mo- Monty Python. Which is okay. And he like, said episode. something in the background and he's like, and Una was like, no, you didn't sign the waiver. Oh, yeah. And he was yeah, like, Yeah, yeah, that did happen. <laughs> okay. I think. It did. Okay. I trust you. <laughs> I don't like it sounds familiar, but I don't I remember it. To you. it did happen. Why would you do that, Kenzie? <laughs> I'm so mad at you. Oh I can't God. even look at what? you. For the quiet place, we yeah. should just be like <laughs> Wait, 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 Kenzie, if that's green tea, then does that mean that your hair is also green? Oh, <laughs> oh no. Just a point. Just a just a <laughs> something I wanna <laughs> call attention to. Why are you looking Guys, around? Is Kenzie actually the Grinch? Whoa! I am because my mom wants to get a Christmas tree, and it's November 9th. I love that. Shout out her. to my mom. Shout out to Kenzie's mom. Shout out my mom. No, my mom. <laughs> you do <laughs> need to like ep- mom. episode. Oh yeah, I need to. Every episode I'm on, I have to shout out either my family or just like my mom specifically. I feel like every episode I'm on, it sidetracks to us talking about the randomest stuff. Mm-hmm. That's not that's just y- when you're on. That's every episode. <laughs> we are talking every about Christmas. Every single episode. We just get distracted easily. It's okay. We get back on track eventually. Like right now, for example. Aww. Does anyone... We have like two minutes left. <laughs> okay. Do Put it have- in two times speed. <laughs> Speak in two times speed. Go, 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 okay, go, go, go. go. I, I was just going to say, does anyone have like any other points in the movie that they really wanted to talk about? It was too many songs. You already said that. Anything else? Pardon? Too many songs. Two mm. times speed, two times mm. speed, two times speed. Just, just talk normally. How much caffeine is this? Okay. <laughs> um, I'm trying to think. Uh, I didn't rewatch. Normally, I even if I have seen like the movie that we're talking about, I always rewatch it. Uh, but I didn't rewatch it today because it was free on YouTube before, but it isn't anymore. Yeah, I noticed that. It's tragic, honestly. That's because they found so out upset. they found out we were gonna do it for the podcast, and they hacked into this. No, Luke Ekstrom hacked into the system, and he was like, "No podcast." I go, 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 no go, podcast. Go, go, go. I, go, go, go. I don't know. Um, Evil. No, it was the little Ekstrom and his keyboard doing that. <laughs> okay, um, I wrote a movie about that. That that that's why okay. I. Um, <laughs> but uh, actually, Michael, I am yeah. curious. What's up? What makes you prefer this one over the other one? Because my parents were saying that the other one was better. I Which do one? like the other one better. Oh, the, the first one. The um, I haven't. I I apparently have seen the first one, but I don't remember it. What, what uh, the first one? Oh, the older one. Yeah. Um, 
I don't know. I think I saw 2000, the 2007 one first, and then I saw the, what, 1988 one second? Yes, yeah. sir. And then I was just like, my my bias was just for the 2007 one. And I was like, this. I think it was just because it was like better quality and stuff, and I just liked the actors better in the 2007 one. Zac Efron. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Zac Efron, ex- sus- specifically. Link Lock and... <laughs> Not a, fan. not a fan. Dude, this podcast is only this podcast is almost thirty thirty years or thirty weeks old. Pardon? What? The podcast. <laughs> it's like okay. thirty weeks old. That's I not, didn't realize we've had huh? this many episodes. The podcast is thirty weeks old. Oh oh episode twenty seven. Yeah. Yeah, this is the It's 27th. almost thirty. It's almost thirty weeks. Well no, it's more than thirty weeks because we've missed a couple weeks. But we've been busy. Or we weren't able to, like, yeah. this podcast yeah, the studio wasn't is open. growing up too fast. <laughs> it's they grow, grow up so fast. fast. It's not us, though. <laughs> not because us, we no. still have, like, no. No, we're like, um. <laughs> we still like, get sidetracked like, very easily. We're like a cartoon where uh, the episode, like, resets the world every it's day. Like so Ed, they Ed never and age Eddie. and they never, like, well, like learn Ed, their Ed lessons. Yeah. I don't. I've never seen that. I've never either. <laughs> I just know their names are Ed. Ed. And Eddie. And Eddie, Eddie like, the. Sorry, never mind. <laughs> if you the bring up Iron Maiden. Weird gorilla. His name is Eddie, okay? His name is Eddie. Is that a gorilla? No, what? it's, it's Eddie. a skeleton. See, it looks like a gorilla and a sea monster. It's, um... A gorilla sea monster. I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> gorilla sea monster. And this isn't the time or the You're place right. for it. We're talking about hairspray. We haven't... We Quiet talked. place? The quiet... It's not the okay. time or the quiet... <laughs> Place. Uh, uh, <laughs> okay. Okay. Slapping my knees. I'm so funny. Right. Um. Also, can I just say I was for a musical called Hairspray. There wasn't as much hairspray as I thought there would be. That's what I was confused about. There was like no hairspray. It was That's just a giant. I expected can. it to be focused around hairspray. Yeah. There like, were like two mentions of hairspray in the whole thing. There was um hairspray because like the the guy who sponsors uh the corny collins show is the guy who owns the hair the hairspray that they're talking about mm-hmm. um and i liked the i liked the number where um at the end during the corny collins show they're having that whole number about um hairspray uh and then the they like spray too. i really oh, like yeah, it I after they, and they like spray each other with hairspray like it's so funny um i thought the i yeah. thought the plot of this movie was like she got on the show and then like, you know how people were obsessed with having that poof? Mm-hmm. So there was a hairspray epidemic. No hairspray. She lost her poof, and she was like, what am I going to do? I literally thought that was the plot. Yeah, you I should like, write that movie. I should. <laughs> anyway, should we do final thoughts and ratings? Uh, should oh, we? Oh, Lord. All right. Um, I'll go last, then. Kenzie, go first. Final, final rating. We're waiting. Out of five or out of ten? Out of five. What do we do every time? I five forgot stars. I've been here in forever. All right, buddy. Two. I was not a fan. All right. Not a fan. Too too much music. Even though it's a <laughs> it's a musical. Musical. <laughs> That's fair. Musicals aren't cheaper yeah. by the dozen too. Right. Uno? Maybe two and a half. Too much bad music. Mm. <laughs> like. They should have gone into like rock segments. <laughs> I would have loved that. I would have. That would have been cool. Um, I think my final rating is probably, I would say like 3.5. I, I didn't, I do enjoy it. Like if I'm ever like bored or anything, just throw on hairspray, you know? Mm. Cause like mm. the, the songs are like generally upbeat. There's like a few that are, that aren't as upbeat. Um, I also, uh, oh, that reminds me of, um, I really like the song Big Blonde and Beautiful. That one, that one just is like, uh, I don't know why, but it sends such like a nice, nice message that I just really like, I just really like hearing, you know? Like the whole, the the whole, um, I don't know, I, I don't know, the whole like message of the, the musical was just like, like people who are different stand together and then, are you, are you seriously doing this while I'm talking about this topic? <laughs> I was trying to tell you there's 60 seconds left. <laughs> All right, then. Well, that was 30. 30. Okay. All right. Let's find whatever. Let's end it on that then. Uh, Kenzie, next movie. Let's go. The Quiet Place. I said all of the movies. Sure.
all of them. That's, I, that's, can we do that? Take it up with Dez. <laughs> I thought it was just the first one. Okay, first one. I don't know. It's just, just the quiet place moment. That would be like an hour and a half. Okay, well, I don't know. I didn't make this. Okay. I'm going to stop being so loud. They're going to get us. Yeah. Shh. Okay. Michael, stop being so loud. I'm not doing anything. You seem like you'd yell at someone in the middle of it and you're like, shut up. Yeah, okay. Okay. You All don't right. have to call me out like that. I'm just saying. Okay. You seem like you okay. tie your shoe in the middle All of right. it. All right. All right. That's All right. It. That, that's, Bye. That's, that's, we, we did right. it. Quietly. Sadly. <laughs> All right.